Dear Aunt Lucy, today we went shopping. At least we tried to. Although he doesn't know it yet, Mr. Brown needs a new car. Henry, why do you insist on hanging on to this old car? Because, Mary, they knew how to make cars in those days. Just feel the quality of that. Oh, oh, oh whoops. Uh, left, Paddington. Yes, Mr. Brown. I don't mind doing the turn signals for you, because yours are on the blink. You mean off the blink? As you know, Aunt Lucy, I'm a big believer in coincidences. And when I read about a competition in which the first prize was a Rolls Royce, I just had to enter it for Mr. Brown's sake. All I had to do was think up a slogan for these delicious new <coughs> currants. Mrs. Brown, does the taste of these currants remind you of anything? Oh, they taste like cough syrup. Yes, I thought it was just me. Mr. Brown? Oh, turn here. Right, Paddington. No, the high street one way. Left, Paddington. No, it's right. Left. There's someone here who wants to speak to you. You see, Mr. Brown, if you drive all over the road, no one knows which way you're going. Oh, but they do, officer. See? We signal with this. Aha! Non-regulation indicators! Oh, they're actually going to make me pay those tickets? Paddington, there's a letter for you. It's from that current company. Thank you, Mrs. Brown. The letter said, congratulations, you're a winner. I couldn't believe it. But I couldn't celebrate right away. I wanted to surprise the Browns. I shall have to put myself at the mercy of the court. Does anyone know where Pond Street is? It's near where Mr. Brown's going. He'll take you. And Henry, none of this would have happened if you'd bought a new car, like I said. Paddington. Paddington Brown. I won. It says right here. There must be some mistake. We've already awarded the Rolls Royce to a gentleman from Scotland. He's picking it up this afternoon. Hmm. Yes, you didn't read the small print. It's hard to make out, but trust me, you're not our grand prize winner. Oh, but you did receive a consolation prize. You and 9,999 others were sent bookmarks. A bookmark isn't much consolation when you were expecting a Rolls Royce. Why don't I give you a crate of currants? We're trying to get rid of them. But I don't even like currants. And I've eaten 15 boxes of them. Between you and me, I don't know how you could stand them. Reminded me of cough syrup. May I ask what your slogan was? A current a day keeps the doctor away. <laughs> well, in that case, after 15 boxes, you shouldn't need medical attention for quite some... Inoperative horn, faulty brakes, and the turn signals don't work. It says here you were all over the road, Mr. Brown. But all minor adjustments, Your Honour. And as for the turns, who could blame my wife if she was mixed up about the directions to the high street? And certainly the um, person who was doing the signals should not be blamed. He's from darkest Peru. Darkest Peru? Uh, let's just say... It was an innocent mix-up. Mix-up, indeed. A mix-up that you ever got your driving license in the first place. But, to show the accused leniency, I will order you to be retested immediately. An examiner will meet you shortly at your car. Oh, and Mr. Brown, I suggest you buy a new one. It had been a busy morning, what with winning a Rolls Royce and losing it all in the same day. I was in need of a little relaxation. Are you Mr. Brown? <sighs> um, yes. Right, let's get started, shall we? Do you have a current license? Ah, uh, current? No, thank you. I've just got over a cold. Now, your license. Oh. Oh, that's my marmalade sandwich. A marmalade sandwich? You'd like them too? Don't worry, I always keep an extra one under my hat in case of an emergency. Let's get started. Please start the car. 
I'll do my best. The only driving Mr. Brown usually lets me do is with my shopping basket on wheels. Mr. Brown? But you are Mr. Brown, aren't you? Ah! Well, yes, I am Mr. Brown, but so is Mr. Brown. He's the Mr. Brown who owns this car, but we both help drive it. He does all the steering and changing gears, and I look after the directions. Right! Yes, just like that. Now, since the turn signals aren't working, I usually use this big arrow in the back seat. Oh, God, new car indeed. Oh, Mr. Mr. Brown! Hello? Right, right, Paddington. Oh, there's Mr. Brown now. Shall we stop? He really is much better at this than I am. Ah! Ah! Oh dear, I think you've hit someone's car. That's not someone's car, that's my car! <laughs> Mr. Brown, thank you for offering to pay for the repairs to my car. And you passed your driving test with flying colours. And for the other, Mr. Brown, here is a special S permit. It's for your shopping basket on wheels. It's a lifetime permit, so I trust we never see you here again. And, Mr. Brown, I think it's time you got a new car. Hmm.